if you're a band, you got to start locally. So hopefully your high school, your college, you're, you're playing clubs around town, and you can get by without an agent for that. But once you get past the boundaries of your city, and you got to go to neighboring things, you got to spread it. I mean, uh, I was always a big believer in, you know, Van Halen was the local band at the Whiskey. People here said, they're at the Whiskey again. They were there for years. Journey was the local band in San Francisco that everyone kind of had given up on. Fleetwood Mac was like the perennial support band that... It starts, and you build and build the foundation. So, I mean, people forget how huge this country is, and now even more so that, tell, you know, when I started in the business, the two no's, the two career, uh, the big <laughs> danger sign for a career was television and Las Vegas. You play Las Vegas at the end of your career, because it was all about selling out in television, just never captured music. You know, Saturday Night Live, I've watched for 30 some odd years waiting to see an act break, and it's never happened. It's somehow, uh, it, it probably ne it never happened up until eight years ago. TVs weren't stereo, the sound didn't come through, they weren't mixed by music people. Today, if you don't get on American Idol or television, you don't have a career. The quickest way to, to jumpstart a career is television. And Las Vegas has more major talent on any given night and on every week than any other place in America. There is, you know, rock venue. I mean, Vegas is uh, the most booked place in the country and is for every kind of act imaginable. So Vegas is, a, you know, totally turned around to being a place that embraces music and the Palms just opened up a big studio there with a basketball court and, you know, who knows who's going to be recording there. But um, television is much more critical today. Uh, you know, it started probably through MTV uh, 10 years ago, but whoever thought that television would be the, the breaking point for an artist's career, but it is now. Um, so uh, it, it can make that foundation, <laughs> the first level of that foundation can be a TV show, uh, but it, it, generally not. You know, they still show up on Saturday Night Live and you don't see sales spike to any huge level on an album sale. Uh, American Idol clearly breaks uh, most of the stars that have come from that. Uh, and, you know, there's other shows, billboards, uh, the Grammys. Sales spike, but not to the level that it really you can point to that being the key point, uh, you know, of, uh, of sales. They're already established if they're on the Grammys. But uh, television is definitely a very real ingredient in breaking an artist today.